Right, hello and welcome back to the fourth episode of my survival series. Now, last time uh, we finished off the, uh, well, the basics of the miner, the mining ship over there. And we've begun construction on the, uh, the tower base. So we've got the refineries here with the speed modules on, with the, the uh, sorters. So that they all have their correct stuff going into them. Now what I'm probably going to do is reflect it on the other side and have some storage down the middle. And have it like that. So let's get some storage plopped down first, I think. Where's my last storage? There's my last storage. So big large storage and again we need them separated well we don't need them separated because um, they don't pull stuff themselves so it doesn't matter if they're right next to each other so lots and lots and lots of storage ridiculously large amounts of storage Did I did I make this like perfect, or did I make it slightly too short for that? No, I made it too short for that. That's fine. I'll just leave it like that. And um, just think, just think, think, think. Right. So that's one row of storage. Oh. Your health is low. I really should stop doing that. I really should stop doing that. Um. So another. Energy low. Yeah. All right. Shush. Another row of refineries here. Let me get it the right way up. Right, so is that the right way up? It will actually like show me from a distance, right? That way. We match it up. So it's one from the end. And there, another one over there. Nope. Wrong. And I've done them all the wrong way round because the backs need to be the way round. All over me. Let's try that again. That's better. Oh, another one. Another one. Assemblers are going to be next, I think. Plop them. Where should we plop them? Right on their side, perhaps. Ooh. Nah, I like them standing up. It's kind of industrial, isn't it? So we'll have a have a row of. Assemblers from there. Big industrial complex. Nice row of assemblers to get lots of nice things done. Don't know why I need that many assemblers, I just think it looks nice. So I'll probably just have some for the looks rather than some they'll just be doing what they're doing. I suppose if we need to make lots of things like solar cells and lots of things that take ages to do then it's probably worth having more than is necessary. And finally stone crushers again. Just a row of them. Uh, 
know what? I'm thinking maybe the second level should be storage. So these. So the conveyor system can go straight up rather than sideways. How the hell did that happen? My god. Really? ramming my face into those wasn't a good idea. Oh, I'm low on hydrogen anyway, so thanks for let me know. Am I lo that low on still plates? Mm. Oh, I better go grab any of that anyway. Ugh. Right, let's put you in there, you in there, you out, you out, you in. in. Well, still plates going on. Yeah, we've got what? Still processing where all the ore because then we'll have to suck it all out of there before deconstructing it. So we've got assemblers and stone crushers there. Um, and I'll cut back to when I've built this up a bit more. We'll be right back. So we've got ports on this thing, two on the sides, one at the top, one at the bottom. Ah, there's one at the bottom. Okay, right. So we're going to have to do things funnily. Right, so I've put modules on everything. And what I've realised is that with bringing everything in the top, it's going to make putting stuff in very... Well, getting stuff out again a bit more difficult from the side. So otherwise it would just link it all together and it would be a complete mishmash. Which is not what we want. So, I'm going to have to rethink this slightly. I can either drill out a trench at the bottom and connect it underneath, bring these in underneath, or I can... Well, I think, that's the, I think that's the only option, actually. <laughs> I don't think there's any other way I'm going to do it, the way I've positioned them. I could reposition them, but... I don't think I can really bother with that. So... Um, Make sure which way where the position of the thing is. So for these, it's going to be in less corner here. And for these, it's in obviously in this corner here. So I don't need that there. I don't need that gone either. Or that. That should be fine. And I'm going to if I go put it in. Not so damn catwalks. I need girders to build these. Let's go grab some girders. Please insert girder, as Bender would say. Alright, girders, 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 where's some girders? Where's some girders? Uh, more girders. There. Oh, so it's uh find a way at that large amount of silicon we had. And look at that, it's nice little large amount. It's all in there, so it's, it's just churning away with what we've got. Which is fabulous. Should work like that, but then I, can I get down there? 
do that. Still can't do anything. Yeah, that works fine. That works fine. But I don't know if I can build a conveyor under here. We will soon find out. The answer to that would be no. No, it won't let me do that. Okay. In which case, might have to do some drilling to make it fit and make it look nice. I'd quite like to put those catwalks on top. Unless we can. If we do this. And then a catwalk on top. Delay place in there. <laughs> okay, so in order to let me do it, it's going to have to be done like that. It's going to leave a little lip, but. To be fair, I think this could look quite, quite okay. I don't know. I don't know. Because you can see the conveyor underneath. Yeah. I think that might be alright, actually. Yeah. Does that be sunk in? But if you remove those bits, it pops up. Okay. Noted. Well, we'll figure that out once we've got the conveyors in. So. There's that. Um, well, if we just. We don't want to disconnect it, do we? That would be, that would be bad. That would be very bad. No, we've done that wrong. Or have I? No. But then how are we going to get it under there? That's going to fall in. Oh, we'll have curving connectors. It's fine. It's fine. We've got to connect up to these anyway. So we'll figure this out as we go. Right. So if we connect up... If we see, we could go along here and go up to the storage area, and then these could pull them out of storage. I think that would look pretty cool having all the conveyors going up the middle. I think I might do that, and then we'll just just connect it all up. Yes. then if they're pulling out of the storage I need to put them back into the storage system so I need to reconnect them up into here so we want another one perhaps there um We need to prevent stuff from in here. Well, stuff from there shouldn't go into the refinery because it's already refined, so that should be fine. Um, yeah. So, is that the conveyor there? Another one there. That should be hooked up to 
go up. So, but then I can't get these two. I need to make sure I can still get them to weld them. I think I'm okay, possibly. I might have to grind one bit down to do that. Why won't you let me rotate? Why are you not? Why? You... Thank you. Stupid. Alright. So we have to start on the next floor to make sure it's all magically hooks up. I don't want that sticking out there, so I'm going to have to do another row, aren't I? Yeah, I did. Wow, that was a bit silly, but never mind. It's all good, it's all good. We can just adjust later on with the struts and things. Alright, so that should be the next floor. Actually, no, because it's got to go above that. <laughs> it's got to go above that. Flying upside down again. Flying upside down again. Right, so that one's not high enough, and that one is. So that's how high it's going to be the next floor. Um, might have to go out a bit. Well, I think out this way is probably where we'll have like a lift to go up. Work that out later. We'll get the main sort of structure, and we'll work that out afterwards. Alright, so I'm not going to fully construct this floor because it needs to match up with the storage. I got that there. Oops. Uh, put one in to test. Large cargo container. Put one at the edge. Another one. There. Like that. That is going to be slightly wide there. Let's move them over one. Fancy. Because we're going to put the conveyor sorters on the tops of these. So we just go bam and in. Like 
that. Does that work nicely? Kind of will. So that's for putting in all constructed stuff. And then we'll have um, think so we'll have connectors of on the outside to put it in. So that the system can connect it all up, but it's only allowing things one way. Yes. So Plans, plans, plans. Sure, I think what to do next. Uh, let's put in the rest of these. And then we can get the conveyor system sorted. Built out too far. Never mind. Just Is that the right height? I'm not sure. If I'm wrong, it can be adjusted. Oh, got that right from the ground. Look at that. Okay, the framework in. Somewhat supported. Yes. It's also want to block these in because I can get in the backs of these and things like that. Be nice. So yes, this is getting quite the project. Indeed. Um, so yeah, we'll do a little bother. Uh, few bits and pieces and then I think we might be done. So let's pop these on there, one of those and one of those. That's just the start of the storage area. Right, so I think on that note, I think this might be a bit of a shorter episode, um, and I will probably do some more of this up camera, get a lot of it welded up and things like that, ready for the next instalment. So please like and subscribe if you like and want to subscribe. Um, and I will see you next time.